does suggest the reputation of news organisations is in decline. It found that more than a quarter of American citizens now think that their president should have the power to close media outlets deemed to be behaving badly. Artis Caleb Mopin took to the streets of New York to get opinions on freedom of speech. The American media just can't get over the enemy of the people label, first slapped onto it by Donald Trump a little while back. Enemy of the people, I think, crosses a line. I think it's reckless. I respectfully ask that it end. This is a phrase that has a long historic provenance. It goes back to the French Revolution. It goes back to Stalin, to Mao. When the president attacks journalists, we question his motivation. At this point, you could dismiss the comments simply as media oversensitivity or bias against Donald Trump. However, whether it's media partisanship or Trump's behavior, it seems pretty clear that public support for freedom of the press is stark. Now, at this point, less than half of Americans say they believe the mainstream media is working hard to engage in honest reporting. Now, what's more shocking is that 26 percent of Americans, more than a quarter, say they believe that the president should have the authority to shut down any media outlet that is engaging in what they call bad behavior. Now, it's not surprising that most of these media haters are Republicans, and it's no secret what outlets they want shut down. Do you think that's surprising? Do you, do you think a lot of Americans agree that, that media outlets should be shut down? I do. I think they're smart. If you're smart and you have a good mindset where you see different things and you would know things like that obviously should be shut down especially if they're not telling the whole story that's a joke that's a joke once again let's go back to page one freedom of the press yeah. right to an opinion those 26 percent may not know the constitution i'll be brought well i mean i don't think the press should be closed down but it doesn't mean we have to read it or pay attention to it i just block it out um, I don't really know what their definition of bad behavior means. Um, if there was a clear definition of bad behavior, I don't know, maybe I'd agree with that statement more. Of course, if they're um, imposing violence or inciting some kind of non-peaceful motion, then I don't agree with them, and then maybe they should be looked at more in depth. But um, in terms of shutting them down off knee-jerk reactions, no, I don't agree with them. It now seems that the First Amendment is the first thing that many Americans want to be amending. Caleb Moppin, RT, New York.